my quest as an architect has really followed two paths. They're intertwined, but they are nevertheless two, uh, focus, two points of focus. The first, which begins with my work in Habitat, is focusing on how to humanize megascale, how to deal with density, congestion, um, essentially, how do we deploy towers, high-rise buildings, to create urbanism, and how do we create the quality of life within them that we seem to uh, react to so negatively. And yet, also in parallel, particularly as I started working in the city of Jerusalem in the rebuilding of the historic city in the early 1970s, I became obsessed almost to the, on, uh, to the question of can you build authentic contemporary architecture in harmony with the cultural heritage of a historic city? Which led me to the greater question of how do we create an architecture which belongs? Not one which you import, preconceived, but one that grows out the culture, the climate, the history, the way of life, uh, the specificity of design. What makes it unique to a place, to a program? What inspires me most as an architect? It's a favorite uh, jour journalistic question. And my response is, I'm most inspired by the design of nature. That while we learn a lot from the work of architects be before us, but in design in nature, you understand how fitness and fitness to purpose uh, achieves extraordinary beauty just through evolution. This is the wing.